Oh. Uh, bro. Yeah. It's fucking 5.15. And my man here is just showing up for work, bro. How, how would he fly in the military, bro? <laughs> You're in the Air Force, right? Yeah, that's a brave man. How would he? How would you work in the Air Force, man? Excuse me. Yes. I was doing two job before I came here. Oh, you were doing another job. Two jobs before I came here. Oh, so you did something else? See, I came here before. Now I come again. I got you. Because this place makes me more. So you were fucking your you were fucking this, your girlfriend. This, this place makes me more horny than the other. <laughs> <laughs> what is it about this place, man, that makes you want to... Is it George? George turns you on. George turns him on. He wants to for a sex change. You're getting really pissed off. He keeps talking violent shit. Just just do the work, bro. Do the job, man. I don't care about that shit, man. Just do the job. Piss off. No time for fucking piss off. Fuck this shit, this boy, little shit shit, you know? Just do Get over it. Fuck it. Get fucking over it. Yo. When it comes to you, when it comes to a, a me, myself, and I of Amir, right? Mm. Who's the boss? You. No, no, you, I'm not your boss, bro. <laughs> I mean, but who's in charge of you? Who dictates when you're going to show up or when you're not going to show up? You do what the fuck you want. Things are beautiful. Yes, uh, seeing you is a beautiful thing. Good. I That's feel the same way about you, bro. All. Oh, this is a good cut. I would like to deal with my customers naked. If they're women, right? She, 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 she got tampons hanging from her. She had what? Tampons. Tampon hanging. Yeah. Wow. Bloody. Bloody. That's nasty. Oh, it happens, bro. It happens. Come on, man. You gotta be vampire. That's fucking nasty. You gotta be vampire once in a while. What? Yeah. You can get your red wings. You eat, the, you, eat the, you eat French fries without ketchup? No. You, it doesn't taste good. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. You do that. Don't be weird like that. No. Whatever you hear. I'm not. I'm not. This, this thing that you created is beautiful, man. Yeah, she got to put the fax machine over there. She got to put laptop over here. You it's know? beautiful. This is custom cabinetry. Oh, so, yeah. yeah. It's beautiful, too. Beautiful quality, man. Yeah, I didn't uh, finish it, you know. But, no, but uh, it's very nice. But I gotta put polyurethane on it and everything, you know. No, but I think it's very beautiful. You like it? Oh yeah, you definitely have a talent, man. You could build a whole, a whole house, no? I'm gonna put over here a uh, one-way mirror, so she can nobody can see this side. But it's beautiful. George, George is so fat, people can see him. Also. Well, uh, who's I'm fatter than him, no? Oh no, you're not fat. No. This is just, uh, you know, people, uh, the way they see it, things, you know? Well, I'm, I feel fat. I, I, I am fat, bro. P-H-A-T. No not F-A-T. What does that mean? P oh, P-H-A-T. <laughs> <laughs> How's the job going, bro? Well, I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. I don't want to work because I don't have the material. I don't know. Fucking asshole, you know? And, uh, English, bro. Nobody understand uh, what the hell, uh, you know, I'm speaking, but, you know, nobody understand what I'm saying. I need uh, some material to start working. I need slip lock, I need screws, I need uh, plywood, I need uh, some material, man, so I can start working. But the problem is, you know, so I what, got nothing. Well, you're saying, you're saying they're giving you a bum rap here because the guy doesn't have the materials to do the job. Exactly. So I'm going to war without a bullet, like exactly what it is. Right. I'm going fishing without a fishing pole. You know? Dude, when you're when you're in a war you need a lot of fucking bullets, bro. Yeah, when I go If you run out of bullets you can't fight the war. Yeah, I'm gonna go fuck but it's no pussy. No pussy. <laughs> 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 That's difficult, bro. That's what I'm saying, the same thing. You have if you're no gonna material. drink with no fucking booze. You have no material. You got an empty cup. Empty cup, exactly. You the got material. uh you got a fucking uh, and especially, a especially, bun with no burger. Especially the cliffs getting harder every day. They're waiting for us, but it's nowhere to be found now. Action! Just right here. You're making a cigarette right now. Yeah. Put a little bit of tobacco here. Look this fucking twig. Fuck. Go like this. Wow, that's it. That's all. Let's see if manager of these kind of cigarettes. You can put uh, 
Natural, no, no chemical in it. No chemicals? Yeah, natural. Or added it free? So he left, he, thought he was afraid of asking for fucking money. That's why he left. So put me, put me on the job. Put me on the job. Okay. Fucking George, you cocksucker, you left? Without saying goodbye? What kind of fucking okay. shit is that? I'm here working fucking late for you, trying to make you and your wife happy. I'm breaking my balls, my ass, my back hurt, you know. And I gave him a fucking massage. You know, he never gave me one, you cocksucker, you. Where's when I see you, all right? I want to fucking, I want to slap you with my fucking balls on your face. You, 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 you and George, <laughs> you and George seem to have a love-hate relationship, bro. <laughs> the last time you wanted to marry him, bro. You know, you want to marry the guy? I don't think I want to marry you him. You want anymore. to turn him into a woman? Think, I don't think I want to marry him, turn him to a fucking female. Anymore. You would get a massage to him? You no, know, I want to just cut his fucking teeth. And then he's telling you to suck his dick and he wants uh, to knock out your remaining teeth, bro? Yeah, I know. And then now you're, you're talking about beating him up, bro. I, I, want, to, I want to let him, you know, what I'm going to do, I'm going to chop his dick off and stick it in the ass, you know? <laughs> and keep it in there. <laughs> uh, reserved, you know? <laughs> Oh, those are some strong cigarettes, bro. They're not. They're very strong. You want to try one? No, 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 thank you. You don't no. smoke. No, no, no way. No, you don't smoke. I want to quit. Fuck that. Fuck this. How long have you been smoking? Uh, since I came to America. Fuck. When was that? Uh, 1980. Wow, not too long ago. 79, yeah. Why'd you come? I felt horny. <laughs> America is like a big giant pussy. Everybody come over here to fuck it. You know what I mean? That's what it is. <laughs> George is the clit of America. <laughs> He's the clit, you know? I don't believe he loves, huh? He loves. Well, he'll be back soon, man. He better He'll be, be back. back here in about three or four hours. Three or four hours? I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm going. I'm fucking. I don't know how I'm going to make it home. Three o'clock. I'm getting. Yo. What's up? Is it true what I'm hearing uh, from Mrs. George that uh, you may be firing a mirror? Yo, fuck that guy. Seriously. Listen, I lost money yesterday. He's got a fucking power steering leak. I told him, listen, we're going to buy him a rack and pinion. I said, listen, we worked a deal out this how much it's going to be. I gave him three, four hours more. The guy's fucking incompetent. I don't know how the fuck he stays in business. I told him I like him as a person, but if I ran my business like that, I'd be fucking bagging that great. Well, why, why were you trying to help him, man? Why? Because I know him for a long time, friend of the family. And, um, and then on top of it, he goes to my back office, takes $25 synthetic Mercedes transmission fluid, doesn't even ask me to put in his fucking rust bucket 95 caravan. So it's either I let him go, I just redecorate his face because I'm at the point where I'm going to start fucking him up. This morning I came in here, you left a big fucking mess over here. Yes, yeah. I had to sweep everything up. Look at the parking lot. Come on, I mean... Why, why are you so violent, bro? Listen, because... Oh, no. Okay. Yeah. Listen. Why are you so violent towards Amir? He's your friend. Why do you keep talking violence? I'm going to knock out his teeth. Listen. The guy has no fucking teeth, bro. Listen. Did you know that? I don't care. No, but how are you going to knock out his teeth if he has Yesterday, no fucking I'm, teeth? I'm, I'm fucking... I'm, I'm talking to a customer, you wing by and he violated me. He grabbed you in the ass? No, he fucking brushed up against me. Anyway, listen. He, he has a thing for you, bro. Listen. I'm here, 7.30, yes. so 2, 1 o'clock in the morning, 12 yeah. o'clock, I get the yeah. best customer service I can, yeah. pick up, cars clean, got my trailer service, yeah. I go to Manhattan, I go everywhere, pick up all new clientele, yeah. I'm on the internet, I got two phones, Right. I take care of my customers. You do? I go somewhere else to get something done, and I don't believe what kind of fucking stupidity people are. Yeah, I but you knew me. that Amir was a little wacky when he started. I, was, I think it was kind of like a project for you to try to take him under your wing and, and help him out, you know? Yeah. You helped him, helped him out in a bad spot. Home. No, but I mean, he was in a bad spot. You can see the guy was like fucked up in between jobs. You know, the thing situation wasn't good for him. He needed to get his tools out of pawn. But basically, that's his own fault. But you're a nice guy. You want to help him. Listen, my you ass, gave him a chance. My ass is only so deep. Okay, listen. 